Starting your practice today here at the center of your mat, lying down in your savasana or your corpse pose. Allow yourself to gently ground down here. All of your body press into the mat. Widen the feet, widen the hands, maybe palms facing up. Option to support your savasana today. Find blocks, one or two, maybe place one here at the middle back, another here at the back of the head to make a nice pillow. Or maybe find pillows, blankets, or bolsters. Place them here at the bottom of the knees to give yourself a quick micro bend to start. Slowly find yourselves grounding down, closing your eyes here for a few moments. Noticing how you take your inhales and your exhales. Soften all of your body. And notice the sensations that are here right now. With every breath that you are mindfully taking, allow these tensions to softly melt away. Inhale through the nose and out through the nose. Soften all of your head. Relax the eyes. Rest the cheeks, the teeth, the jaw. Allow all of your shoulders to simply melt away down into your mat. Release every single tension in your hips. Softly feel heavy in all of your legs, your ankles, up to the tippy toes. Breathing in and breathing out. Starting your practice with a mindful intention a mantra or an affirmation to set today, something that can ground you down or something uh, that can pull you through as you navigate your breath in each and every asana. Begin to come back to your present moment once you're ready. Wiggle the toes, wiggle the fingers. Maybe open the eyes easy. Slowly come back to your present. Gently releasing the props that you may have used. Starting your practice today, lying down here. On your next inhale, start with your banana asana. Swinging all of your legs to the left side. Maybe your right leg on top of your left and slowly swing your hands to the left side as well. Left hand catches the right wrist. Feel that lengthening more on the right side body. Inflate on the right lungs. Let your ribs on the right side open up more. Feel this energy from your right ankle towards that right middle finger. Allowing yourselves more space. Soften the breath. Release the tension in your neck. Inhale through the nose. Exhale gently through the nose.
Come back to your present moment once you're ready. Release at the center. Slowly do this on the opposite side. Banana asana on your right. Left leg at the top of your right leg. Maybe catching that left wrist with your right hand to feel more opening on your left side body this time. Allow a more breath on your left lungs. Let your left ribs expand. Relaxing your head. Softening the hips. Inhale through the nose. Exhale out through the nose. On your next inhale, come back to your present moment, releasing all of your feet. Bend the knees one by one, windshield wipers left and right. Neutralizing your spine, neutralizing your hips. Finding your first twists for today here. Slowly bend that left knee towards your heart. Clasp your hands on your inner thigh or your left shin. Option to stay in this opening or slowly find your easy twist here. Left knee drops into the right side as you extend that left hand to the left to a T. Find a block one or two, place him on your left shin if you feel like your left knee will not connect to the earth. Find your left thumb, left shoulder or close your eyes. Option to stay in this shape or slowly bend onto the right knee. Left hand catches that right ankle in your left foot. Noticing how you can be more open in one side. And knowing that you have an option to less intensify a shape or an asana. Know that each shape and each pose that you'll be doing for your practice today will be coming from a place of honesty. Inhale, make some space. Exhale, take that space to find a deeper twist.
a moment to release on your next breath. The last thing that you did is the first one that you release. Come back center and swing that left knee to the left side. Find a quick opening. Begin to do this on the next side. Right knee to the heart. Clasp the hands wherever it wants. Maybe to the inner thighs or maybe to the shin. Option to stay here or if you want some more, find your easy twist. Right knee drops onto the left side. Point your flex that foot. Heart opens to the sky still. Find a block, one or two. Place them on your right shin, right knee. Gazing at your right thumb, right shoulder. Close your eyes. To go further here, bend that left knee this time. Grab that left foot, left ankle with your right hand at the back. Softening the hips. Sending your breath on your lower back and your middle back. Come back at the center, open the eyes, release. Whenever you're ready, bend the knees one by one, windshield wipers first, just making sure nothing is painful. And begin to come back to the center, leaning into one side, finding yourselves here on your tabletop. Shoulders stack onto the wrist, hips onto the knees. Open the fingers out wide. Quick cat and cow here. Inhale, belly to the floor. Open the heart forward. Exhale, round the back. Inhale, tailbone points to the sky. Exhale, tailbone points to the knees, chin to chest. Finding openings and undulations here. Opening each and every part of the spine. Let it articulate mindfully here. 
one movement, one breath. Lengthen as you exhale. Deepen as you inhale. Finding your melting heart or your puppy pose here. Extend your hands forward as you melt your heart down. Option to plant the forehead or look forward. Find your chin pressed down. Blocks, pillows, or bolsters. Place them here in your heart and your head if you feel like this is too much for today. And if this is not an option, if you want to go further, just place your head down or all of your heart down into the mat, keeping your hips stacked on the knees. Option to tuck or untuck both of your feet here as well. This can come intense easily, so know that each and every option is there for you. Allow the shoulders to open. Allow all of your back to open. Release on your next breath, plant the hands back to your tabletop. Maybe find a counter stretch cap in the back, chin to chest, and then slowly come back neutral. On your next inhale, thread that right hand up and then over to the left side. Right shoulder plants down, release that right temple down into the mat. Option with your left hand, a forward maybe, or to the sky, or take a bind at the back, maybe it can catch your inner or right thigh. Keeping that open heart, relax the shoulders, roll that left shoulder down and back. Soften the face and feel this deeper twist.
begin to release on your next breath release that left hand down counter stretch right hand reaches up high inhale and then slowly come back tabletop once you're ready do this on the opposite side left hand up high breathe in Thread it to the right side, breathe out as deep as you can, as far as you want with your left hand. Still stacking your hips on your knees. Right hand this time, forward, up, or take a bind here, find your inner left thigh this time. Roll that right shoulder up and back, and then slowly begin to close your eyes. And navigate your breath here in this counter stretch, counter twist. Releasing the bind on your next inhale come back to your present moment left hand up high breathe in Breathe out come back center swing the hips side to side making sure nothing is painful Come back neutral on your next breath big toes touching at the back find your child's pose Extend your hands forward chin down or forehead down into the mat Allow the hips to come onto the heels Let all of your forehead plant down and root down to your center. Soften the neck. Maybe find awareness in that crease between the forehead and the nose.
on your next inhale begin to come back open the eyes slowly tabletop rise swing the legs to the side take a seat here at the center of your mat finding your next pose or your asana extending that right leg in front left foot steps near the left glute maybe near the inner right thigh or maybe come across that right leg right hand right arm wraps on your left leg left hand here at the back beside of the hip inhale to lengthen and exhale to open the heart to a twist on the left side option to gaze at the back maybe look at your left shoulder or close your eyes here not much weight on that back hands you can feel more of this twist on your lower back and your middle back Come back center on your next breath, releasing the bind, releasing that left foot to the top. Try this on the opposite side. Right knee bends, foot near the glute, the inner thigh, come across that left leg this side. Left hand, left arm wraps in your right leg, right hand reaches the back. Inhale to lengthen and exhale to open up to your twist here on this side. Gaze at the back. Find your right shoulder or close your eyes here for a few moments and notice how you breathe into this counter stretch.
release on your next inhale releasing that right foot right leg on top shaking the legs starting with your next pose here find yourselves on your tabletop once more left foot slowly plants in between uh, the hands find your anjanyasana here squeeze the inner thighs together and let your hands here stay at the sides maybe hands up and overhead as you open your heart to the left side left hand at the back right hand at the front as you hook that elbow on your outer left knee take your hands in prayer press it here to the center of the chest to find this anjanyasana twist heart opens gazing at the back your left shoulder or close your eyes feeling this twist noticing how you find your balance On your next breath, releasing this twist slowly, come back to the center. And then slowly release, hands framing that left foot, release to your tabletop. Swinging the hips side to side, begin to do this on the opposite here. Right foot steps in between the hands, squeeze the inner thighs together, hips are square. Whenever you're ready, take your hands to the sides or maybe hands up and overhead. As you open your heart to the right side here with a twist, left hand forward, this time right hand at the back. Option to stay or hook that elbow on your outer knee. Hands in prayer here, press it to the center of your chest. Gaze wherever it feels good, maybe down, back, or just close your eyes here, allowing this opening on your back. And finding yourself rooting in your balance as well to stay in stillness.
We release back to your center. Find balance, first inhale and then slowly come back low lunge. Release back to your tabletop. Swing the hips side to side, wag the tailbone. Tuck both of your feet and take a seat here first at the back of your mat. Push your hips onto the heels. Option to untuck both of your feet if this is too much today. Collect the hands on the center and slowly, mindfully take a deep inhales and exhales, fully reaping the benefits of your twists. Come back to your present moment. Whenever you're ready, open the eyes. Or reach the hands forward, tapping the toes if that was too much. Cross the ankles on the back and take a seat here at the center of your mat. Once more in your easy sitting pose. On your next inhale, hands reach up high. And then slowly heart opens to the right side. Left hand on your right knee, right hand here at the back. Release your shoulders, come away from your ears. Find a deeper twist here by placing that right hand binding on your inner left thigh. Gaze at the back, your right shoulder or close your eyes here.
releasing your twist on the next side here heart opens to the left side right hand on your left knee left hand here at the back roll the shoulders away maybe take a bind here left hand on your inner right thigh this time gazing at the back feeling this twist on your neck as well maybe close your eyes for a few moments to find this counter stretch Come back center on your next inhale. Begin to open the eyes. Releasing the bind if you did that with me. Hands reach up and overhead. Hands in prayer. Exhale. Hands in prayer to the heart. Namaste.